I just recorded this entire commentary and forgot to mute my TV. I don't know why I was playing with the TV not on mute, but I guess I was for some reason. And uh, that just completely compromised this entire this entire video. Um, anyways, hello guys, what is going on? My name is Shifty, and today we are going to be talking beer. And I'm not talking about just like small shit. I'm talking about stuff that like hinders you useless in society as fear. When I was growing up, me personally, I didn't I didn't have like too many fears. I wasn't like afraid of everything. But there there was just some weird shit that I was afraid of as a kid that made absolutely no sense to me then and makes absolutely no sense of me now. Like one of my biggest fears as a kid was draw bridges. Like, you know, draw, like, just straight up draw bridges. Yes, exactly what you're thinking of. I don't know why I was so scared of draw bridges. I think I was afraid that they were gonna, like, open up while I was, like, driving over them or something. I have no idea why draw bridges would scare the shit out of me so much as a child, but they did. And I have, I have no idea why. It doesn't make sense to me to this day. But every time I would drive over a draw bridge to go into the city, I would just get, I would just have a panic attack in my head like we're gonna die we're gonna die i think it's because like as a kid i watched some of these movies i don't remember and what movies in particular they were but uh like it would typically be like a police chase or something actually i think it was in like the blues brothers or something it was a police chase or basically like the the, the blues brothers made it over and then the cops and shit got stuck on the drawbridge and the drawbridge started going up and raising and i don't know why but like that freaked me out so much as a kid. And it's it's really weird to think about because that's really not that big of a deal. Like just, it's a drawbridge, Aaron. It's a drawbridge. Like there's famine and poverty and war going on. We could potentially be on the theoretical break of a new nuclear war some, one of these days. It's just like, why was I scared of drawbridges? But yeah, out of everything that I could have potentially been afraid of as a kid, you know, making new friends in school, any horror movie ever, it was drawbridge. Like, and obviously just, you know, normal stuff like spiders, but that's kind of a given. Everyone hates spiders. I never understood those people. I always, oh, that always pissed me off. Those people that would be like, there'd be like this just giant, huge, massive size of like a small dog spider on the ground. At least in my, in my imagination, it's that big. And they're just like, dude, what are you so worked up about? It's a spider. It's like, you don't get it. Nobody understands it except for people that are afraid of spiders. That it's a friggin' spider. It's just a spider, man. Like, calm down, bro. It's just a prank. No, it's not just a prank. It's not just a prank. God damn it. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I love those things. People are like, come on, I'm gonna get so many kills on this thing. And then and then they legitimately get shit. <laughs> this kid's probably so pissed right now. I wasn't even trying to take it out. I just wanted to like I used to do that all the time back at Call of Duty 3, because you used to be able to ride in tanks. And like the tank's uh, like main gun had a really wide like turning radius, so it was really hard to like catch up with people that were running around it. I don't know. I guess the question that I wanted to ask you guys is, what was your biggest fear, growing either growing up or now? Just like the fear that you've had the longest, or the fear that you have the most. Either of those, because I have no idea why draw bridges was even a problem for me. But it, it's legitimately, it legitimately sparked fear in me.